morning to you ladies, my name is Jacksepticeye and welcome back to a number of games in one video. The series where I have no idea how many games I'm actually going to end up playing, so I just downloaded a bunch and we play a bunch of them and see what happens. What do you mean what's the theme for today? Doesn't always have to be a theme every time I do one of these videos, okay? It could be anything, it could just be random ass games, that's the theme. The theme is go fuck yourself, go home. There's no one there, I'm talking to nobody. It's comedy, everybody! Show business! Where's the first game? Is it here? Oh, it's down there. Okay, bring it in. This game is called Crunchy Lunch. Now, I had a Crunchy Lunch earlier because I had a bit of salad. Um, I didn't. I lied. I'm, uh, I, I had bad food. I had, my Crunchy Lunch was Pringles. <laughs> so technically, still a Crunchy Lunch, but if anyone asks, it was a very nice salad and it's very healthy for me and my mom's very happy. Okay, so, I actually don't know what this game is. I just loved the style of it, so... Oh! I actually have to click, okay. Started a new job today. Exhausted. Barely able to write. Job good! <laughs> I think. One problem. Office quiet. Too quiet. And the lunch I brought is loud! V loud. V crunch. Not sure what do. Is this Kevin from the office writing this? Got a PB and J sandwich. Good lunch, not loud. But problem. Not enough food. Needed more. So brought snack too. Baby carrots, pretzel sticks, weird Trader Joe's salty Peruvian corn. Those are all very loud. Oh shit. I actually got to pick one. Oh, never mind. Pretzel sticks. Pretzels boring, but dependable. Could eat a million of them. But problem. <laughs> I take first bite of snack and my vision goes blurry. I actually thought that my vision had gone blurry. Fucking hell, it scared me. Crunch! Small office, quiet office, loud lunch, got big crunch. What will boss think? New guy, loud chewer, sloppy chewer. Bad at chewing, bad at job, fired! Yeah, that's how it goes, you know, fear leads to anger, anger leads to hate, hate leads to snack, snack leads to crunch, and then you're fired. Don't think boss would actually fire, seems too nice, but problem. No clue how to say nice boss's name. No, it's spelled Marianne. Well, I just told you how to spell, or how to say it. Looks easy, huh? Wrong. Everyone in office say name different. What? <laughs> okay, a, a drowning person is talking. Um, I would say Marianne. Oh god, it's the chorus of a thousand... Okay, that's how you pronounce it. That's what I hear in my nightmares. Mary Ann? No. I'd say Marion. Oh, I'd actually say, yeah, Marion. Marianne? Marion. I'd say Marion. When in doubt, middle it out. Marion. Too nice to correct anyone. Haven't seen Marion's boss yet today. I keep going to say Marianne and now I regret my decision. Who is also my boss? My double boss, really. My big boss. Important man. Busy man. The crispest pants. <laughs> You notice the weirdest things. Oh god, what if first thing he hears is crunch? He'll say, Marion, who's slop, slob crunching in office? Crunchy slob equals bad worker. Bad worker equals fired. Grab your pretzels and go. No, double boss probably too busy to notice. Dignified man reminds me of grandpa. Grandpa was kind man, stern but kind. Not much of talker. Creepy taxidermy, but kind man. Picky eater, whiskey drinker, but kind man. Pretty tolerant man, considering. Although had thing against Chinese. Didn't like their food slash communism. <laughs> Grandpa nice man, stern but kind. Creepy taxidermy, but kind man. Very racist xenophobic, but kind man. <laughs> Might have voted Hillary if given chance, but problem. Grandpa had fatal pulmonary embolism due to factor 5 Leiden mutation. 
Jesus Christ, not sure what those words mean, but God, hope disease not hereditary. But problem. <laughs> what if I fatally pulmonary embolize right now? <laughs> Me equals dead before even finish lunch. Oh God. Mental picture, picture of Marion at my funeral, making small talk with my parents. Your son, nice young man, but problem. Didn't know super well, but great resume. Actually funny story. Your son's death. Day he died, he was eating lunch. And he crunched. He crunched it so loud like jackhammer. Everyone laughs. Now that's how I'm remembered. Flash forward 10 years. Dad's at diner in Midwest. Truckers everywhere. Trucker behind him chomps some potato chips. Suddenly, dad starts crying. <laughs> what the fuck am I playing? Everyone real worried. He says, sorry, sorry. It's just you remind me of my son. The way you crunch. More tears. Oh boy, I need to make decision to eat or not to eat. Nobler to eat food like crunchy slob or to stop and suffer hunger pangs. You know what? I'm gonna stick with it. I'm gonna stick by the fact that I'm a good worker, nice person, no problem. To eat crunch problem. Food still super loud. Everyone in office hear me. Probably in building, everyone in building hear me. Jeff in mailroom like, Hey, who's crunching? Child in Japan like, is that Godzilla? <laughs> Child's mother like, no, just super loud lunch in USA. Crunch! Am I eating the paper I'm writing on? No problem. Me equals strong. Me equals unembarrassed. Me equals marathon runner, but for eating. Me equals Iron Man. Crunch! Marion looking at me now. Her face says, wow, what a crunch. What a man, what a man, what a mighty good man. But you know what? It okay to crunch. We both humans here. Humans crunch. We slobber and sweat and fart too. Suddenly me think Marion wife material. Do you know how many moms poop during childbirth? Google it. Surprisingly common. Me? I took massive dump when birthing daughter. Suddenly, Marion become irresistible to me. Worth it. Daughter equal angel. Point is, no need to be embarrassed by crunch. Because you probably rode into world on a mudslide. Ew! <laughs> I look back and my face says, thanks Marion. Marion? Mary Ann? Needed to hear that. Not so much poop part, could have lived without poop part. But rest is good advice, and I thank you. And so I make it through first day. Maybe tomorrow, bring softer snack. Applesauce? Gummy bear? Tough lunch, but I survived. Now just gotta do same thing every day from now until retirement. And or death by embolism. <laughs> Oh, that was fucking fantastic! I love that! Oh, Jesus. A game by Yoss. Oh, so good! I love that. All I could hear was Kevin from the office saying all of those words in my head. Oh, that was so good. <laughs> Maybe die by embolism right now. Maybe pulmonary embolism right now. Or pulmonary embolize. Oh, what a fucking great game. Anyway, that does it. Shoo! Bring on the next one! Wow! Holy crap, look at all those colors. Jesus, what? This is a game called Bread. And I make the cutest, squeakiest little feety noises. This is so cool! <laughs> hey, it's my little dog. Hi, can I pet you or do anything? No, nope, I make a, a whip and a squish sound when I jump. Look at my six shoes. This is me. Age 12. I was born without a face. Okay, I don't want to watch TV. Can I go outside? What the hell do I do? Yes, do! Okay, that's- that's your motivation for today. That's your PMA for today. Just go out there and yes, do! I accept the guy.
Johnny, that's him. Left click to interact. Okay, that his family, drawn by me. Maybe the, maybe the theme for this episode is bad grammar. Oh God, this friend, he outside, he very creepy. Okay, oh, I have to make toast, but I need my bread. No toast, go store. Love mommy. Okay, how do I go store? Can I go out? Hey, I can go out. Hi, abomination friends. Oh my god, what is this? Look at the happy smiley mountains. <laughs> everything has a face and it's terrifying and everything's 2D and I can't see my friends anymore if they turn sideways. Can I talk to any of you? Oh my god, I can run. <laughs> oh, it's like being a kid again. I can't go in there. All right. This is a horrifying nightmare and I love it. <laughs> now that's dangerous. If that car's coming at you, you can't see that. Store with bread. Thank God, that's just what I need. Do you think they only sell bread? Okay. Hi, it's me, a friend. Hi, friendo. What are you buying? You're buying Arlo the rabbit and a scully spoon. We got some clapsters and some deluxe. Scully spoon included. You wanna buy some ducks? The fuck is this game? We have some beans! <laughs> but it's spelled B-E-E-N-S, not to be confused with B-E-A-N-S, which are pronounced bonds. Cause Sean, Bon, it makes sense, okay? The Sonic hat, I really want the Sonic hat. I, I, in fact, I'm pretty sure that I need the Sonic hat and a pencil. He's buying some soup! For his group! Okay, that's, do you wanna buy a sleeping child? Whose sassy lost child is this? Life secrets! Oh, I need them. Actually, no, I don't want to know life secrets. I'd rather find out on my own. Oh, sneaky thiefy! You can't see him, he's invisible. Shh! Okay, I can't sprint in here. Which is kind of annoying. Alright, let's get some broad. After I talk to my friends over here, look at that tiny child. Good friend studios, Arlo the Rabbit, cool. Is this not bread? I, I, honestly, I don't know what bread would even look like in this world. There's, of course, the bread is just... <gasps> they're sold out of bread! I guess the store is out of bread. I heard a rumor that in the depths of heck lies the last loaf of bread. I'm on my way to get it back. To get it, so back off. Oh, god. Oh, we're actually in heck. You can't say hell, it's about... It's a bad word, my mom's gonna fucking kill me. I mean, my mom's gonna heckin' kill me. What's up, skelly boys? Can I have the bread back? Welcome to heck. Free bread. I don't trust this. I don't trust a big Satan demon man. What? <laughs> Did I just get the bread? <laughs> Even the fucking clouds and the sun have faces on them. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I love my little squeaky feet. That's exactly how I want to walk around town. Just annoy the shit out of everybody. It's like Robin's animation, where the little speedy feet like ding, 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 ding. <laughs> So cute. Okay, back home. I want to make my heck toast. Oh, we're, oh, look at me. I got my bread. <laughs> this my bread. Time to make some heck and toast, y'all. <laughs> Wait, writers? Writers of what? <laughs> writers of store with bread? Oh my god. <laughs> I just love that at the end. Yeah. <laughs> well, we did what we had to do. We rised, we rose, we grinded, we rise and grind gamers, and we went out there and we got that bread. That's what the analogy is. You have to go out there and get your bread. Go out there and make that bread. Make that cheddar. But for now, it's gone. It's over. Get it out! Stupid 
game and can't play you anymore, all right? It's over. We finished you. Yeah. On with the next one. <laughs> Fucking hell. Okay. This is a game called Drunk, or D-R-U-N-K, which stands for Drunk and Reckless, Unforgiving Neighborhood Kilometer. Okay, and we get to play as a man who looks like he has a penis on his face, but I'm not one to judge. It looks like Jason Statham got rolled over by a car. Okay, movement is W and A, S, and D. Oh my god. Okay, I get to home. I love that place. I go there every day. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Try not to walk into obstacles you have tried once. Okay, so, take your time. Take your time, this is fine. This is just a Friday night, all right? I'm Irish, I should know how to walk home drunk by now. Easy fucking does it there, buddy boy. Ew. Dude, it's the middle of the day. Have you really been drinking? Oh, God. Ah! Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Oh, God. No, no, no. Fucking bin! Garbage day! You have tried two times. Okay, fucking. It's time to speed run. It's time to. It's time to speed run! I got this! Uh, chicken tikka masala, what? Okay, okay, go, go, go. Go, go, go. Okay, no, stop. Stop. Stop it! Stop it, geek! Okay, yeah, see, stop! It's telling you to stop. Alright, take it easy there now, bucko. Oh god, there's a fucking bridge. Why do I live here? Ugh. I had a fucking great time out with the boys. I feel... Fantastic. I... I... Drinks up, motherfuckers. Look at my package! I got a straight up bulge going on! That's what happens when I drink. No, stop. Stop, okay? He has a bit of fucking forward momentum going on. Okay, okay. Oh, come on! Are these not checkpoints? They fucking should be. Oh god, oh god. Ugh, I'm gonna puke all over my shoes. Can we? Can I? <laughs> so I'm guessing that they're not checkpoints. Okay, fine. Whatever. I can do this. It's... I have betrayed my whole life for this. Just because I had 17 pints doesn't mean I'm not a real boy. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Watch your step. I'm in a... I'm in a hole. I'm in a pit. Call the police. I need to get home. They're showing a marathon of Mr. Bean on TV, and I really want to watch it. Ugh. Okay, okay, okay. Are you burping and vomiting and... Or is that... Is that shit coming out of your mouth? Okay, okay. It's fine. It's fine. Fuck the bins. Okay. Just take it easy. That's all you have to do. Really, it's all about just taking your time. Oof. Oof. Okay, okay, easy does it there, Jimbo. Okay. Okay, I fucking f I feel drunk playing this. Alright, don't fall off the edge of the world! Okay, you just take your big old fucking tablet looking head and take it home. Oh, come on! It's old naked men on a segways! Is that the only one? Can that please be the only one? I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna go this way. No, oh, fuck. Okay, okay, we're almost home. We have to be almost home by now. This has to be it. Ah, go! That fucking slow ass sir! Oh Jesus, oh Jesus! It's fine, it's fine, I got this. Oh God, the final steps to my house. You fucking whore of Babylon! Oh, come on! Play video games for your living. It'll be fun, they said. You really enjoy it, they said. And you know what? They were dead right. This is fucking awesome. You guys want to see how far I can puke? You want to see if I can hit that kid down there? Okay, be careful of fucking Segway Steve coming down here. There he goes. He looks like the fucking... He looks like a thinner version of the old man from Up. It's like they took the old man from Up and just stretched him out. Okay, come on, plastic head. Oh, you are so lucky that that didn't fuck us up. All right. Easy peasy. I'm getting a feel for it. I know how these legs work now. When your legs all work like they used to before, Ed Sheeran was fucking right. Okay, wait for Segway, dick. 
Oh, that could have fucked me up royally. All right, here we go. All right, last hurdles. Are these the last hurdles? I actually don't know. Oh, fuck. Oh, wait, I have to go over there? Are you fucking serious? Why are these not checkpoints? What's the point of even having the stop signs? Oh, Jesus. Oh, no, 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 no! I don't know what you're talking about, Oscar. I had a great time. I know where my home is, but... Right now, I'm gonna have... I don't have to go. I'm gonna have to get this game out of here, okay? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, new game. Oh, okay. That's how you wake up in the mornings. Okay, this one is called Quit the Game to Win. So I don't know if I actually should just sit here. And this is like the entire game, if I actually just sit here and look at it. But, I'm a bit of a rebel. Oh! The button disappeared. Oops. Escape and Alt F4 won't work either. Oh, shit. Sure, there's the task manager, but that's cheating. That way you'll kill the process, not quit the game. What about that X button in the top right corner? <laughs> oh, one of these games, is it? Nope, but there must be a way to touch it. I think it just needs a friendly approach. Be gentle. Come on. Maybe if I press X. I'm trying to be gentle, it's not working! Okay, let's try with some relaxing music. Oh. Nice. It's still not working. I don't think it's working. I don't either. Jesus fucking Christ! Fuck yeah! Enough of this lullaby bullshit! Let's try something else! Oh man, I think we scared it off. I was having a fucking great time with that one. Here, take this. It surely looks better. Wait, where did it go? I don't know. I guess it's hiding somewhere. Can I just click, not have to click this? Maybe it's a shy one. Try calling it by its name. I'm not an object. All right, try calling him by his name. I'm a she, thanks. Fine, would you please try calling her by her name? Um, X? What? C come out, please! Oh! There you are, you shy little bugger. <gasps> I actually had to press X on my keyboard to make it come out. We got it! I mean her. Now click on it, uh, her. Did we just win? Oh crap, I guess we didn't. Nope, here we go again. Oh god, this is like, a uh, uh, like Stanley Parable or Dude Stop kind of game. We were so close. Wait, I have an idea. When the lights went off, I think I saw something. Like a switch behind the title. The circuit breaker, not the console. Anyway, try moving the tile down on this text box. Wait, what? <gasps> Wait, I can't... I can't, I can't do it! I'm clicking it, but it's not working! Wait, 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 wait! What, what am I supposed to be doing? Can you, like, piss off over here? Oh, I have to put it in that text box. Got it, my bad. So! That was the main power switch. What's that dangling thing? I don't know, but I want to click it. There's a blinking light now. Look, another one. Kill the process. Wait, don't touch that button. Oh, this is like don't press the button as well. I just realized something important. Killing the process is quitting the game. And that means I'll cease to exist. How could you push that button? How could you kill the process? After all the time we spent together, after all the challenges we faced, how could you kill me? Okay, fine. I won't interfere with your choices.
you know... As a real epic gamer, I really want to press the button to win, but... I just can't bring myself to do it. I can't bring myself to hit that button. Come back, Texty! Come back! We can be together! We can go to France! We can live out our lives! Texty, please! Baby, come back! There must be another way! This is so sad. Alexa, you're not in this room. I think I'm gonna have to do it. I think I'm gonna have to quit the game. I really wanna sit here and wait, but... Oh. Oh, music just repeats. Did you really think it was that simple? Nobody's gonna kill me. You're not gonna win this game. I will win this game. How? I will quit the game. Wait, so it ends when the game quits itself? That's weird! Holy shit! Okay, I wonder if I go back into it, will it say something else? Um, hello? No. It's still the same thing. Okay, well how about if I just go to the task manager myself now this time? And delete everything, and end the process. I win this time, game! Go fuck yourself! Okay, well... I guess that does it for this video. Um... There's no real way to end this, other than, like... You ha- you have to quit this video. You have to do it, otherwise I'm just gonna be here. You have to be the one to go. You have to be the one to leave. I can't end it for you. You're gonna have to do it. You're gonna have to take the power into your own hands. You're gonna have to click that X at the top right. You're gonna have to pause the video. You're gonna have to end it yourself. Don't mind about the rest of the timeline bar that's after this. Don't even hover over it. Don't even look to see how much of the video is left. You're gonna have to quit it. Can you give up YouTube? Can you stop? Or do you have to watch? Every day, do you have to be here? Do you have to watch the videos every single time? Right to the end. Do you have a problem? Do you have a problem with YouTube? Are you watching too much? Are you getting that watch time? You're gonna have to do it. You're gonna have to leave. You're gonna have to take matters into your own hands for the first time in your life. And you're gonna have to do it. Otherwise, I'm just gonna be here. I'm just gonna be here all the time. Staring. Watching. Waiting. You haven't met me in real life. How do you know I even exist? Or if I'm not just existing here, on YouTube, on the platform. Forever. How do you know I'm a real person? You don't. The only thing you know is how to quit the video. Right now. Still here, I see. Very good. Can't do it, can you? You can't just end the video. You have to stay. You have to watch. You have to know what happens. Just in case something's hiding, something's lurking, just in case you miss something, you have to be in the know. You have to know what's going on, don't you? You can't just let it go. You can't just move on. Otherwise, it'll always be in there. Scratching at your brain. What happened when I clicked off the video? Was there more? How many of you exited the video and came back? 
just to see what was happening. Because you can't do it. You can't be left out. You can't just move on from things. You have to know what happens. You have to be here to watch it all. You passed the test. Now let's move on to the next phase.